Yeah, what we found is that people who skip breakfast were more likely to be the big weight gainers over time. If you have three meals a day, you probably have fewer calories spread out during the day, where if you skip breakfast, and you have all of your calories during just two meals, you get much bigger spikes in glucose and much bigger spikes in insulin. Your glucose spikes because of what you're eating your meal and your pancreas makes insulin to absorb the glucose. But insulin is also a hunger hormone and it also ultimately tells your body to store fat. So if you have huge ups and downs in your insulin, your body's more likely to store more energy as fat and also to feel hungrier three or four hours later. I like low-fat or non-fat yogurt with blueberries on top, and sometimes I actually put some, some bran on top of that. I do like whole grain cereals, um, and for that, again, I use those that have little or no sugar added to them. And finally, in the winter, when it gets a little cold, we make up a batch of steel-cut oatmeal, sometimes a little honey or sometimes some berries on top of that, too. Probably a lot of processed meats are not so good. That would be the bacon and the sausage and the ham. There's a lot of sodium in that, and they are um, not great because they're pretty high in saturated fat probably the highly refined cereals. There's a lot of cold cereals out there that only have zero or one gram of fiber that really are a lot of added sugar. And those are really tough on your system. And of course, America loves donuts. Um, a lot of donuts is not good. They're gonna be high in um, refined grains, which again is gonna be problematic for your blood sugar. Now what about eggs? What we find if you follow tens of thousands of people is that an egg a day actually is not that bad. It's a good source of protein. And we find that people don't have higher rates of heart disease or diabetes with an egg a day. If you have two or three eggs every day, then the cholesterol in the egg can start to add up and have an impact. But one egg a day really is not so bad uh, because for the most part, the cholesterol in the egg does not turn into cholesterol in your body.